Good. How you doing? Good to see you again. You uh, too. Former Patriot League rivals. Yes. Yeah. Uh, the Red Raiders used to take it to the lake when we were <laughs> going to travel up to Quincy Youth Arena, uh, but always a good spirited rivalry. What do you think for this year? Um, we uh, we graduated. We only graduated about four or five guys, but those um, those five guys. One was a goalie, a senior goalie, and three of them. Uh, chipped in for you know just a measly like 89 points or something like that so we've lost that obviously but um we got a good core of seniors coming up um there's about 10 of those guys and you know about eight of them played last year so that's 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 um it's good experience for us we got a couple of juniors and we got a decent freshman class so our numbers have been down the last couple of years and this year uh we've actually boosted up a little bit so uh we're hoping we haven't had a jv program in a couple of years so those freshmen kind of get lost a little bit on, on, on trying to get some ice time. So I'm uh, hoping next year is going to be the year we get the JV program back. But we're excited about the freshmen that, are, that, that have come this year. Some, one's a goalie, and he's actually going to be starting for us. Um, and then we got a couple of the guys that can contribute right away. So That's great to hear. Yeah. So what, what have you seen this week that, that is uh, exciting for the young uh, We scrimmaged yesterday, and, and uh, I'd say the young guys jumping in and, and actually contributing a little bit and making hockey plays, I guess, not just getting rid of the puck and not being scared. So. I was a little bit nervous yesterday with our first scrimmage to see how those guys reacted. You know, we threw everybody into the fire and just see what uh, what they could do. And I was actually very um, Im impressed with how some of those guys were playing. So it's uh, it's promising, at least. Sure. And what are you expecting to get out of today here at Garrett Regan? I mean, the whole, I mean, just being here with all, you know, all these coaches and players and everything. And it's just a really cool atmosphere and the kids as well. And, you know, you, you bump into kids that you've coached in the past or guys have played with different guys in the past. And uh, it's just a, it's a fun event. And then you get to play a couple periods and see how the kids react a little bit and, and enjoy the day. So. And what are, you th uh, what are you thinking as far as the Patriot League is concerned? Where do you see you guys uh, fitting in in the league this year? It's, uh, as you know, it's the, the Patriot League is a grind. And, uh, every night. Every night. It, it's, it's a really, really, really competitive league. So you have your... Your tough ones with your with your Duxburys obviously on the other side. So the other side is Duxbury and then everybody else. It seems like trying to trying to fight for that spot. And then uh, on our side, I mean, Situate, Hanover, Pembroke, Plymouth South. It just they just keep coming at you. So twice, twice a year. Twice, too, right? twice a year. So at least we only have to play Duxbury once a year, but we get to get all those guys twice a year. So um, you know what? We just it's just a. If you, if you can get yourself into the tournament, this league really, really prepares you for that for that battle. So that's that's the hope. The goal is to get the tournament, and I think the bumps we'll take along the road and the Patriot League will help us, uh, hopefully, for a run. Absolutely. It's been a pleasure being here with uh, North Quincy head coach Matt Gibbons. Uh, Matt, best of luck this season. Thank you. Appreciate it. Hope Good to see you. Good to see you around the ranks. Absolutely. Thank you. Thank you.